After the Islamic Center burned down in 2013 in one of the largest fires in Winona, First Congregational Church opened its doors to the center for prayer services. Well, now the two are coming together again, this time to raise money for a new building for the Islamic Center. News 8's Sarah Tamer is now here with more. Mike and Martha, members of the Islamic Center and members of the church are coming together tonight, and it's not the first time. This time, a dinner will be held to raise money for renovations for a new building. Previous fundraisers were not enough to cover renovation costs, and the Islamic Center hopes it will raise enough money for the new place it will call home. I was shocked. I couldn't believe that was happening over there. When a 2013 fire burned several Winona buildings, an Islamic Center was caught in the ring. It was really, really sad to see a beautiful building so nice. You know, I mean, that was all ruined. The aftermath of the fire left members of the Islamic Center wondering how they would be able to move forward. I stood there and watched the building burn down, and watched the building being torn down. And it was like losing a son or a daughter. But when a familiar neighbor learned about the fire, they decided to step in. The important thing is that we, we, we come together as a community of faith regardless of, of, of how you call your God. Winona's first congregational church opened its doors and allowed a struggling group of people a place to practice their religion. We're all just trying to help each other out um, and probably this is a good opportunity for people to meet Muslims and they'll realize they're just like them, you know, they have the same, the same kinds of issues. And along with the church's help, the Islamic Center is also thankful for a Jewish friend who handed me the first check as a donation. Students from Winona State's Muslim Students Association say they are overwhelmed with support. I'm coming from Pakistan and you know we, we have never experienced two religions working together and uh, we helping them, they're helping us. Um, everyone's been really, really, really cooperative. We are very grateful to anyone and everyone that extended their arms, not just their hands. Those at the Islamic Center also say they are thankful for St. Mary's University, the Newman Center, the Lutheran Church, and everyone else that helped out during the difficult time. The fundraiser will be held tonight from 5 to 8 p.m. at Winona's First Congregational Church. Thanks a lot, Sarah. The fundraiser is sponsored by the Muslim Students Association, and dinner will be provided for donations of $10 or more.